This is how to get your own custom skin in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Now, Minecraft Bedrock Edition actually limits the amount of players who can get a custom skin by only allowing it on PC and on phones. So, you're going to need to actually be on one of those platforms to have your own custom skins. And I'll be talking a little bit later about how to actually make your own skin within the Bedrock Edition kind of skin creator. But anyways, let's get into this. As you can see, I have my own custom skin imported on here. And how do you basically do this? Well, what you're going to want to do is open up a new skin. Once you're here, you can click on Edit Character. Now you're going to click on this little hanger. And once here, you can click on this Own Skins button right here. And just click on this gray outline, which is just basically a base of a skin. And once you click on this, it will go through your files and allow you to import a special skin. Now, you can import your Minecraft Java Edition skin or any Minecraft skin that you can find. But obviously, these skins, once you import it, are limited to uh, the Minecraft Java and just Minecraft skin creation kind of limits. So, I'll be going over also the creator marketplace kind of type skins and uh, basically how to do that. But obviously, just do this if you want your own skin without having to buy one of the basic ones. But obviously, if you actually go through the creator, which automatically implements you on here, all you have to do is simply click on this little person, and you can edit a bunch of your stealth. Now, what's really important over here is just basically the stuff that it gives you. Like, it allows you to have some custom animated stuff, as well as like backpacks, which are basically similar to capes. But obviously, capes are a little bit different. And you also need to disable your cape if you want to enable any of the backpacks. So just remember that. But if you want these, these are the only real reason why you'd be doing that. As you can see, if I go here, change classic skin, and then go to the body, it will actually not allow me to put these on my custom skin. So just note that, that everything that you actually buy here, you can't put on your own skin. So that is just really important to know right now because if I go back here and equip it, as you can see, nothing has saved since I only have this skin on. Which is obviously a pretty big problem if you want any of like the custom 3D type stuff. But obviously you do not need it, but these things can be really cool being animated and 3D. Which basically any normal skin cannot have. But obviously most of these will cost you money. So, I would really not recommend it if you don't want to spend any money at all. But obviously, there's some free stuff. And currently, at the moment, the marketplace is giving out some free stuff for their five years on here. So, if you head over to the marketplace, marketplace five year day celebration right here, which is pretty good. And you can claim last day's stuff right over here. So, you'll just get a bunch of free stuff that you can also put on your avatar as well. But that's how to implement a custom skin on here. Subscribe for more.